Hey everyone, it's Jen. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel today. Uh, I am packing up the uh, prize package for the winner of my Valentine's giveaway. So I thought I would come on and uh, show you what I am sending to the winner. So if you didn't see who the winner is, you could go ahead and uh, take a look at that video, which I, I'll link down below. But um, yeah, so I got a box out. Uh, it's about an eight by eight square box, very good size. And I lined it with some tissue paper. So I have a stack of handmade goodies that I wanted to send to my winner. So let me just show you the things that I'm gonna add. I'll start with the big things. I'll put those in first. Um, this is a little egg treat box that I made and um, it's so cute. It's got a shaker on the front. And on the inside, I put in some uh, cards that I made for some design teams and um, a little mailbox. And there's a tag flip that has some embellishments in it. So hopefully the winner likes this. I just thought this was the cutest um, little package. And I did put it in a um, plastic bag so everything doesn't spill out. So this is the one, I think this is the one that we made together on my tutorial, right? because I had two of them. I think this was the one that we made. So this is going into the box. So put that in there. Might have to rearrange this uh, at some point, but we'll see how it goes. So there's that. And then the next big thing I have is this mini album that I made for Scrap Diva Designs for a guest designer. And oops, a little butterfly is a little bent, but isn't this such a pretty little album? Oh, I love it. And inside it has some uh, little packages of embellishments and it has butterflies that the recipient can take off and use. So, um, well, when she takes that out, that'll flap back out the right way. So this is going into the package as well. Okay, and then I think we'll add, let's see. I have this candy box. This I also made for Scrap Diva Designs. And oh, I just love this. I filled it up with little, uh, not styrofoam, but little like foam hearts that are packaging material, but I think they look really cute in there. And uh, there's, oh, I love that acetate. It's got little hearts on it. Cute trim on the end. So this is going in as well. Let's see if we can stick that up. Yeah, that stands up nicely, so that's good. And then I have a couple of boxes of things. I have this box that I made for um, design team and this has little faux wax seals in there. That's for KS Craft. And then this one as well. This is a Sweethearts box. Um, the die set from KS Craft just makes the front, but I did make it into a box and then I filled it up with little uh, peeps that I had made, little cutout peeps. So there was some facing front, some facing back, and yeah, this box could be reused as well, like both of those can be. So that's going in. And then here's another box that I made, and I put in a couple of the match boxes that I made too. This is for KS Craft. So um, those are fun to open, so she'll have that as well. Add that in. And then we have this little bag of Dove Hearts, and it's made with a bag topper that has a little shaker on there. And it's put on with removable pop, dart, pop dots, so she could go ahead and take that off and reuse it. But um, yeah, cute little Valentine gift, I think. And then I had another one too, and this one has little X and O and heart beads on it. So super cute. And then um, some dangles that my friend Nikki sent to me and it's a cute ribbon and just love that little face. So that's going in too. Okay, let's see what else. And then I have this um, handmade, this is a, a gift card envelope. This was a die set from KS Craft as well. So I just have my um, uh, business card in there, but uh, she can reuse this and add a gift card and gift it to somebody for a wintry birthday. So there's that. Let's add that. Let's see. Mm, I think it'll be okay just like that. Yeah. 
And then I have two more handmade things. This one is a little cookie. Well, it's kind of a big cookie that I made from a Dollar Tree um, wood shape. And it's got a cute little bunny face on it. You can't really see it because the die cut is covering it. But um, they're just cute bag topper. This is from KS Craft. This is from Scrap Diva Designs, the, the scalloped hearts. And this, this die cut is from KS Craft as well, but the stamp is from Echo Park. And these papers are from Echo Park too, from that new Easter collection I showed you guys. So I think that fits perfectly in there and that'll be a nice addition to the top. And then I think I have room for one more thing and that will be this um, little pie pin cushion or tear tray decor that I made. There's a tutorial on my channel for how to make this that I just uploaded this past week. So check it out if you would like to see. I made these little pins to go in there as well. And I added some of those little um, foam hearts just to kind of cushion it in the envelope. And I made this bag topper. Again, this is from Scrap Diva Designs. So um, yeah, I'm gonna add that to the top and then I will add a card and maybe a couple more things if I could fit them in there and some, yeah, some more tissue paper and that'll be ready to go. So that is the prize package. Um, if you are not subscribed to my channel, I'd love it if you would stick around and subscribe and I will be having more giveaways in the future. Thank you to everyone for your support and for all the nice comments that I received on the giveaway post. You guys are so sweet to me. I really, really, really appreciate everything that you uh, comment or just a thumbs up or uh, your support in general means a lot. So thanks again. Hope you have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.